couple of times okay. been good attacking positions and they've dropped the ball far too many errors then it throws it's back he's taken by james oh what a hit from chabelle what a crunching tackle but it's still with the ospreys but the clock isn't back behind hook and bishop is there williams brilliant finish from him right at the start of the match but it's asking a lot to go from there even for shane williams parker gets it out tandy's there win jones with a little roll around spice here's walker still using the big man in james to go forward spice again walker again trying to straighten trying to get those long legs through and he's still on his feet also trying to get the ball out williams great tackling there from Sevilla. parker looking calm still took that in a collected way inside the final minute of this match now lee burns calling on this side he reckons there are numbers over here he's working his way towards him but alan Wynne jones goes through the middle drama now in the finish at the liberty stadium the ospreys go for that try to give them a chance of a win it's out picked up again by alan Wynne jones spice to bishop walker heavily involved in this attack but onto the wing and it's ryan jones great strength from him and they are lining up to the right now sell so think they have the numbers it's going to be a good contest if it comes this way it doesn't through the middle they go again a try and conversion to win it they're racking up the phases now they want the points bishop again tandy goes in it's going to be the final play of the match surely this and what a play parker again can they keep their composure can they go wide they're going wide now win jones what a good pass that is hook to shane williams great sidestep can't afford to drop this jonathan thomas hook again is there a way through marvelous defense from sale burn big one man they've got the try williams goes towards the post Shane Williams has scored. Tantalising close now. The referee wants to check it. Did he manage to stay in field? That's the key question. I was breathtaking rugby from the from the Ospreys. They held onto the ball. Great ball attention. We've seen so many errors in the second half. But that time they held onto the ball. Went through all the phases. Well, that's a perfectly good try to me. That looks a perfectly good try. He grounded that ball nicely. But what, what a wonderful try. Everybody involved in the start of that movement. Hell on the ball. Maybe it was their last throw at this stage. Great ball retention. That's what's been missing in the game in the second half. Taking over the ball far too easily. Oh, what a wonderful try. And George Hughes was right to check, you know, it's just too important these days. But Williams knew exactly where he was. He knew where the dead ball line was. He tried to get as close to the post as possible. And now it is the youngster, James Hook, who is faced with quite easily the most important moment of his young career so far. He'd be a goal kicker. This is the moment. I don't know about when he came on, about seizing the opportunity, seizing the moment. What a way to crown a try, a magnificent try like that of a kicking conversion that wins the game. Excuse me, excuse me, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Shane Williams has top and tailed the game for the Ospreys with his world-class try scoring ability. Now can James Hawk kick the conversion to sink the English champions? They can't the opening look. match. They can't look. Osprey supporters just can't look at this. Hook the man who has to. Sail charge! 